This course is the regression analysis using Open Rail Designer. Regression analysis is used to help define an alignment, whether that be horizontal or vertical, along the path of an existing track. Regression is a best fit process whereby the new alignment geometry is defined to fit as close as possible to a collection of known coordinate points surveyed along the existing track. A typical regression workflow consists of importing existing rails, sort the points via a set of values to create the existing rails, convert the existing rails to generate the regression line, create a curvature diagram to create the alignment or use horizontal regression tools for single or quick method, regress the horizontal alignment, report the slews, Create profile using profile from rails to begin the vertical regression. Create the vertical alignment and report the lifts and the lowers. In this course, you will learn how to create a horizontal and vertical alignment along an existing track using the regression tools available in Open Rail Designer. The existing track survey will be our starting point. Exercise one, getting started. In this exercise, you will learn how to start Open Roads Designer, select the proper workspace and work set, create a 2D DGN file, attach reference files, set the active terrain model and define 2D and 3D model views. The skills taught are start open rail designer, select a workspace or work set, and create a 2D DGM file for both the left and right rails. So here we've started open rail designer connect edition. And we're going to set the correct workspace and the correct work set. So the workspace that we're going to use is the delivered workspace which is training and examples. The work set is going to be training metric. And the first thing that we're going to do is we're going to create a new file. And we're going to place the file in our data set folder. So where you've downloaded the data set, that is where we're going to place our new DGN and this DGN is going to be called metric dash e x underscore left rail and we're going to give this uh, new DGN a, a seed file so we're going to hit the browse button and from the data set folder we're going to pick the project 2d seed underscore m dot dgn and once we've assigned the seed file we can then save the file which will in turn open that new dgn so here now we have uh, the new dgn opened and i just want to check some settings of the DGN so I'm going to go to the file ribbon and I'm going to go on the backstage to settings I'm going to look at the settings of the file and then I'm going to go to design file settings and here you can see the formatting of the stationing that you can change that should you wish to I'm going to change it to uh, a, a format that has no plus symbol in it and also I'm just going to check the working units here and you can set an accuracy uh, in this case to three decimal places and just go OK on that and save those settings. So that's the left rail. We now need to create a DGN for the right rail. So again, I'm going to go to file. 
I'm going to go to new. Do the same process, type in a file name, metric dash ex underscore right rail using the same seed file that we use for the left rail and just now select save and this process will have now created the two DGNs that we need to begin our design process. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like. If you want to see more such series, consider subscribing to our channel. Thank you, and see you next time.